Hello everybody, uh, today I'm going to review a um, pedal that I bought and uh, for me it's the best sounding distortion pedal I've heard yet. Uh, it's uh, this one, Black Star, and uh, this is the, the model HG Duo. I guess you can see it. It has one tube inside and uh, it has um, normal input, uh, normal output. Um, emulated output so you can plug it into a console or or even in your DAW and um, two switches it's very easy to operate basically it has three channels this pedal um, the, the clean channel which has uh, a little button for, for to clean and crunch you know here and then you have the lead channel and you can control here the amount of gain for one channel for the other uh, for this one and the, the second channel you can control here the amount of gain and volume amount of gain volume amount of gain and volume also then you have bass middle treble and the ESF which gives you on, on to left a uh, type of American sound and right uh, more of a British sound which you can blend of course and it's a very heavy pedal um, but it's got everything I needed on a pedal it made my Vox uh, sound like whatever I want. Heavy metal, rock, um, uh, crunch tones, uh, f from John Mayer to, to almost Dan McDarrow. It's true. And um, I'm gonna I'm gonna plug it in, uh, make some make some tests, drive drive the pedal. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. And um, this is a really really an excellent pedal. Oh, uh, this is the pedal. Uh, I hope you guys can see it well. I'm going to start to play, uh, I'm playing with the Ibanez, with the Summer Duncan um, and, uh, and uh, the Mars you pick up. Wait a second. Alright. This is a true bypass of, of the guitar, of the pedal. Okay, I'm going to engage channel number one. I'm going to first put the, 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 the gain knob at 12 o'clock. And volume at 12 o'clock too. A little louder in the amp. Alright, so you have the clean and the crunch. I'm gonna click crunch now. I'm in the clean channel. Crunch. Now I'm gonna roll back a little bit of the gain. It has a very very smooth sound, especially my Les Paul, but uh, I'm not. I'm, I'm, uh, I haven't heard the guitar right now. in channel one. A lot of harmonics and I'm using the, the ESF control in the middle so I'm blending the American sound and the British sound. Which is a great sound. If you need a more heavy, uh, I have all the knobs at 12 o'clock. If you need more of a heavy sound, even in the clean, first clean, in the first channel, you get this heavy scooped sound by, by taking off the mids, put more bass, uh, leaving the treble maybe at 12 o'clock. And right now I'm going to move to the British sound. Okay, completely on 10. <laughs>
A very juicy sound, indeed, uh, incredible sounding. Uh, the camera won't probably pick up all the detail, but it's really, really incredible. So I'm going to move now to the um, to the American style of things. You're going to notice. See how the sound changed? More definition, less. Uh, more definition. Okay, everything at 12 o'clock. And the volume. 12 o'clock. Because this guitar is an Ibanez, it's made of bass, bass wood. It's very different from the, the, the Gibson and the, and the Fender, which have their own characteristic sound. And, um, and I prefer the other guitars, uh, but I don't have them here. So uh, in the next video, I'll be playing those guitars and talk a little bit more about the pedal. Thank you for watching and cheers. <laughs>